Hello, I'm Laverne Cox and welcome back to my channel. Yes, today I'm going to be reacting to the 10 most epic moments of Miranda Priestley from the iconic film, The Devil Wears Prada. So I love this movie so much. I'm obsessed with it. Whenever it's on television, I always watch it. I've watched it multiple times. Let's get started. And Emily? Yes? So. Oh, it's so good. What I think I love about Miranda specifically and in her character is that like she acts and behaves in ways that I never could or would even really want to, but would love to, right? Wouldn't you love to just be able to just be like, that's all, and just kind of just dismiss people? Like, isn't that kind of epic and just like everything? But you don't want to go through life like that. Don't do that in real life, but like enjoy. Miranda doing it. Do you know why I hired you? I always hire the same girl. Stylish, slender person. This scene is so good. This is so she's been stuck in, in Florida in a hurricane, Miranda. And Andy does everything she can to get her a flight out of Florida, but she can't do it because there's a hurricane. And so this is the next day when Miranda like lays into her and just, it is so cruel. Andy is just in tears and it's just, it's cruel, but it's, it's, it's delicious. It's so good, it's so good. I said to myself, go ahead, take a chance, hire the smart fat girl. That, whew, it feels like this parental disappointment that is utterly and completely abusive, that can scar you for life. Watching it back, like my memory of it is just like, oh, it's funny, but it's really, it's really, really cool. It's really terrible. Bosses, don't act like this. This is awful. Don't do this to people. Oh my goodness, it's awful. Paris is the most important week of my entire year. I need the best possible team with me. That no longer includes Emily. This moment, it's really the turning point of the film. Andy has to decide if she's going to betray Emily, if she's going to choose to get ahead um, or lose her job. I don't know if I would would have turned down the trip to Paris either. Comment below, would you have turned down the trip to Paris or would you <laughs> would you have gone like Andy? Miranda, about last night, I have- I need the new Harry Potter book for the twins. Okay, okay, I'll go down to Barnes Noble right now. Did you fall down and smack your little head on the pavement? Did you fall down and smack your little head on the pavement? The impossible task that she gives Andy and when Andy can't do it, then she gets to fire Andy and she basically tells her at the end of the scene, if you don't come have that manuscript, don't bother coming back, so. Uh, my name's Andy Sachs. I recently graduated from Northwestern University. And what are you doing here? What are you doing here? <laughs> She's so shady. You're right. I don't fit in here. I am not skinny or glamorous, and I don't know that much about fashion, but I'm smart. When Miranda takes her glasses off during Andy's speech, it's just, it's, it's just everything. What's wonderful about this film too is like about, it's about a young woman who has a dream and who, you know, has all these obstacles that she has to overcome to like make it to that dream. And it's like glamorous, it's about fashion, but it's critical of the fashion industry at the same time. It's just a great movie. If you haven't seen Devil Wears Prada, girl, I don't know, get your life together. I don't understand why it's so difficult to confirm appointments. No, I'm so sorry, Miranda. I actually did confirm The details of your incompetence do not interest me. The script is so... I don't understand. Tales of your incompetence do not interest me. It's just so fabulous. It's a great way to introduce her character, gird your loins from the iconic Stanley Tucci. It's just, I never get tired of it. Never get tired of it. And this layout for the winter wonderland spread. Not, not wonderful, wonderful yet. yet. Iconic. Iconic line. Simply iconic. Morals for spring. 
Groundbreaking. Did I mention it's iconic? And I mean, what if I don't want to live the way you live? Oh, don't be ridiculous, Andrea. Everybody wants this. Everybody wants to be us. Oh, this moment, this moment from the film, it's just so into everybody wants to be us. This very superficial world where it's cutthroat and people stab each other in the backs and are, are cruel. In a way, Miranda's right. Everybody does want to be them, but they don't know the ins and outs. They don't really know. And do if, if they knew what they really want. If you, if you knew the mess of it all behind the scenes, would you want to be Miranda and Andy in that moment? Would you? Comment below. Tell me. They're so different. Mm. <laughs> oh. Something funny. Iconic. There's so many amazing lines, but they got they they, they kind of handled it here. What do you think? What's your favorite moment from Devil Wears Prada? Would you have gone to Paris instead of, uh, and taken, you know, Emily's spot? What are your thoughts? Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you like, subscribe, you know what to do. Turn on the notifications and we'll see you soon.